All right, so there's three problems with the CPI. All three problems overstate the real cost of living, so it makes it look like it's more expensive to live than it is in reality. And if you overstate the cost of living, you are also going to overstate the amount of inflation in the economy. So let's go through these three problems real quick. The first one is referred to as substitution bias. And the main issue here is that for the CPI, the basket is fixed. And in reality, consumers' baskets are not fixed. So they change their baskets when something becomes relatively more expensive or relatively cheaper. So the idea here would be if you have a fixed basket, you miss this idea that consumers lower their cost of living by switching over to relatively cheaper items. For example, if you have in a typical consumer's basket five pounds of steak, and let's say the price doubles, in reality the consumer is going to cut back on how much steak that he or she would buy. But for the CPI, because the basket's fixed, it would still say that you have five pounds of steak in that basket, even though the price has doubled. It'll make the basket look like it's more expensive than what the consumer's real basket is, therefore overstating the cost of living and then overstating the inflation rates.